The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs continues to emphasize the importance of COVID-19 vaccination. Even at a time when in-country, we note a significant decrease in the number of reported cases of COVID-19 infections. This week marked two years since we saw the first reported case of COVID-19 in St. Lucia. During this time, we have all seen the devastation that this dreaded virus caused to our communities and country at large, as well as the global impact. To date, St. Lucia has attained a COVID-19 vaccine coverage of 29%. This accounts for approximately 52,852 persons being fully vaccinated. Another 3% is partially vaccinated and 6,908 boosters have been administered. The COVID-19 virus isn't going away anytime soon. The COVID-19 pandemic will not end anywhere before it ends everywhere. Further, we know that low vaccine coverage makes us more vulnerable and increases the risk of the country for the likely emergence and circulation of new variants. Safe and effective vaccines, which we have at our disposal, are a game-changing tool. However, it's not vaccines that will stop the pandemic, it's vaccination that will do it. Let's be more proactive and less reactive. COVID-19 vaccination have been integrated into all our primary care services. Vaccines can be accessed at all the vac- at all the wellness centers across the island. Equitable access to vaccines is our priority, and as such, the ministry ensures that every individual in every community has access to vaccines for their protection, particularly the most vulnerable amongst us. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs therefore encourages you to take that personal decision to protect yourself and loved ones. For those of us who have been vaccinated, this does not mean that we can throw caution to the wind and put ourselves and others at risk. We must continue wearing masks, cleaning our hands, ensuring good ventilation indoors, physical distancing, and avoiding crowds. It is important that we continue adhering to the protocols. We have seen and know how viruses mutate and other variants emerge. The latest news indicates that a new variant, Delta Cron, has been confirmed. There is still limited information about the new variant. Whilst it seems far away from us for now, remember that viruses can spread very quickly especially through international travel. Therefore, I urge you, citizens of St. Lucia, to take personal responsibility and get vaccinated. Mm -hmm.